Hi everyone, welcome to a new video. Uh, I decided to make another one. Today I'm going to talk about what I think of The Incredibles movies. I am talking about The Incredibles and The Incredibles 2. This franchise is one of my favorite animated franchises of all time. I know a lot of people hate Incredibles 2 because of the villain named Screensaver. I think these two movies are awesome and fun to watch and it's all my opinions on these movies. Everyone will hate me for making this video, but I just want to share you all my opinions on what I think of these two movies. The first Incredibles movie is 14 years older than the sequel. Pixar decided to have that to have it like that for some reason. I don't know about that. My favorite character in this franchise is Elastigirl because she is flexible and she is awesome just like the other characters in this franchise. Before I begin the video, I will spoil um, these movies while reviewing if you for those of you who haven't seen them so let's begin the video on the first Incredibles this one came out in 2004 14 years before the Incredibles 2 when I was little I wasn't sure about seeing this one when it came out on DVD because it looked strange to me but when I watched it a couple of times when I was little I began to think this one was awesome and enjoyable and it is yeah, this one was about Mr. Incredible and Elastigirl got married and they got kids. They all have superpowers, even Frozone. The superheroes were defeating the robot from attacking the city before defeating Syndrome from getting away with stealing Jack-Jack from the Parr family, which is these guys. Yeah, Jack-Jack had powers before the family found out in the sequel. Anyways, this one was enjoyable and fun to watch in many ways. This one came out in 2018, and I was happy that Pixar got a chance to let The Incredibles have a sequel like this amazing film. I love remembering when I saw this movie at the State Theater in June 2018 with my family, because I looked forward to see this one in theaters. This one was about Elastigirl doing the, the hero job for Winston and Evelyn Dever, while Mr. Incredible was being a stay-at-home dad to Violet, Dash, and Jack-Jack. The screensaver Evelyn Dever put the glasses on the heroes to make them under her control. She did under her control, sorry. She did that because she had a hard life in her past. Her parents were killed and she didn't know her brother that well. I was glad they added new characters like Void, Brick, and other superheroes. Anyways, everything about this movie is great and one of the best sequels of animation. And that was it for my reviews of The Incredibles movies. Post a comment, su subscribe, ring a bell for notification. What do you think about these two movies? I will make more videos soon. Bye.